here we go, a 1968 uh, Sport Twin 9.5 made by Avidrood OMC. Uh, this motor is second owner motor. I own it and purchased it from a gentleman, uh, actually from his daughter. He had passed away in, um, I don't know how long ago, but or how long ago the motor was last run. But uh, I'm out here on the on the lake. It's pretty flat. A little bit of rain in the in the sky here, um, but things are going well. I started the motor up already. Started up on a couple pulls, two pulls to be exact. Replaced the uh, or not replaced, but shined up the points and replaced the gear lube. That's really all I've done to this motor. It's uh, in really good shape. It's ugly as heck, but this is the first time out on the lake. Um, since I purchased it and not really sure what it can do. So I'm going to go ahead and start her up and uh, put her on a plane. I'm on a nine foot living stand. It's kind of like a dual hole type of uh, boat. Just really a dinghy and I think this should do just fine on it. So here we go. Start her up. Just pumping water right there. Got to make sure that uh, keep an eye on that because I did not replace the impeller. I suppose it could fail at any moment. I do have another out oh, antique outboard on board, so if she does fail or overheat, or I can certainly get back safely. I'm hoping. So uh, sidle her down, put her in gear, move my weight forward, and here we go. investment. Got to keep an eye out for logs. This design of the boat, the two twin hull, kind of kicks up some water uh, on the front edge of the motor. Shouldn't be an issue though. Might be able to move my weight forward and get that to slow down. Uh, Good motor for fishing, I'm told. Pretty light, low profile, but ugly. I think she does pretty good. Well, I think she passes the sea trials, and I'm uh, not sure what I'm going to do with this motor, but uh, it's a good one, and uh, I'm not going to give it away for free. So, signing off, and uh, go, go do some boating. Happy motoring.